National VA Loans. To contact us at National VA Loans, it's 855-956-4040. Or, of course, you can find us online at www.nationalvaloans.com. As I've been talking a lot about, or recently I've been talking quite a little bit about the VA cash out loan. And the primary reason I'm doing that is because we've had some really great examples come through our office of uh, people, uh, veterans that we've been able to help and actually save a ton of money. So I want to just kind of draw the example out for you on one of our whiteboards just so you can see exactly what I'm talking about so it can make sense. Because usually I'm talking about numbers and money and savings and all this stuff. And boy, unless you can really see it, I mean, at least I know I'm a visual person. I need to see things. Then it's really kind of hard to understand. So I just wanted to kind of break down a scenario that we're going or that we're working on right now. And again, excuse my handwriting, but hopefully you can read this. So on a VA cash out, currently, as the market says, we can do 100% financing on a VA cash out. But we're not going to quite go to this 100%. I want to give you some numbers on, on how it would look. And, and, and again, this is just the scenario that we're actually just closed up on in, in our August. So a uh, home value of $240,000. I have a current mortgage balance of $165,000, which obviously leaves $75,000 in, in uh, available equity. Their principal and interest payment, they're in the uh, with their current interest rate is eight hundred sixty dollars and seventy one cents. Everything looks pretty good. That's they're in a great position, and I agree. Whenever I started looking at the loan, I thought, man, they're they're in a great spot. They've got some good equity. They've got a pretty decent rate. Of course, we can lower it, but not bad. Well, then I started really diving into it, and and, and that's kind of what we do at National VA and Community First National Bank is we dive into these things. We try to figure out the best way to save our veterans money. So we looked at that a USA credit card that it had about a twelve thousand dollar balance, and you guys know that how credit cards work. It's usually about three percent of the balance is what your monthly your minimum monthly payment is. Now, if you make minimum monthly payment, you may never pay it off, of course, but that's what your minimum minimum is, so you can make those payments and they're affordable. So using those calculations, they're paying about three hundred sixty dollars a month on that card. A Discover card about two hundred forty dollars a month. A Capital One card, they have about a $10,000 balance, they're paying about $300 a month. And then a One Main Financial, that's just an installment loan. It's kind of a signature loan is what it really is. It's a, you know, a get you by loan. If something's going on and you need a little extra cash, it's a great loan for that. And it's, this is what they had. And so they pay about $325 a month. So all in all, they had about $37,500 worth, of, worth of, of revolving or installment debt outside of their mortgage. And total about $1,225. Now listen, they were getting by just fine. They were making payments. It wasn't an issue. They paid their bills on time. Everything looked great. But when we started really drilling down, started looking into it, and I saw all the savings we could make for these folks. So what we did is we took the 37, out of our $75,000 in equity that we have available, we took $37,500 to pay off these outstanding debts. And and for those of you who've watched videos and know me, I always say cash in your bank is better than cash in your mortgage. So they also took about $20,000 in cash out. <coughs> On their current situation of eight sixty seventy one principal and interest, and the $1,225 a month they're paying in installment and credit card revolving debt, they're paying about a total of $2,085.71. Manageable. Their debt to income ratio is good. It really wasn't a big problem. But... We were able to get them $20,000 in cash, pay off all this outstanding debt, clear these cards out so there's zero balances, which does a lot of things for them. When those, zero balance, those are zero balance credit cards now, that's gonna increase their credit scores because now they have less balance versus money available. So they have a, there's a large gap in there. They have a large amount of money available or credit available which if you've seen any of our other videos on, on credit and things like that, you'll understand that that's about 35% of your total credit score. So it increased their score a ton. So but what you're thinking is, well, did they save any money? Yes, they did. Their new principal and interest payment with taking $20,000 cash and with paying this debt off was only $1,012 a month. All right, that's less than what they're paying just on these revolving and credit card debts. That is a savings of $1,073.11. Now, I only say we go out five years because, you know, I mean, you never know what's going to happen. I mean, granted, even five years is a long time. But if we looked at a five-year savings, we're looking at saving $64,386.60. 
You can look at it as savings, you can look at it however you want, I guess, but the way I look at it is that's $1,073 a month that you just got to raise. You know, and you have to worry about going into your boss and saying, hey, I'd like to get a little bit more money. I feel like I've earned it. I feel like I deserve it. I feel like I, well, you did earn it. You did deserve it. And this is how we're going to do it. You paid your bills. You've done the th right things. You have equity in your property. And by God, you're a veteran. All right. You served our country. Let us serve you. So we just give, we give the way I look at it is we just gave this gentleman a raise or his family a raise. And $1,073 a month, what could you do with an extra $1,000 a month? I always say there's no extra money. There's just money. Okay, because anytime you have extra money, you find a place to go with it. I know if I said, hey, here's an extra thousand dollars a month, you would find a home for it because there's probably things that you aren't doing right now that you would like to do because you don't have the funds. Well, don't allow these things to stand in your way. If you have equity in your property and you have the ability, this is the time to do it. Okay. Use that equity, and you'll see here that we've left a lot of equity in here. We've even taken $20,000 in cash and put it in their pocket. We've left equity in there. Don't miss out on this opportunity. Rates are at all-time lows. We haven't seen rates this low in forever. The, the tenure, there's just so many things going on. We haven't seen it this low in a long time. So take advantage of it when you can. All right, National VA Loans, we're at information. We're here to help. We want to give you as much information as possible. And as a mortgage bank or a community first national bank, if we can help and actually do the loan for you and make it work, we want to. All right. Again, contact us at 855-956-4040. Feel free to go online at nationalvaloans.com or check us out on Facebook at facebook.com forward slash nationalvaloans. Heck, like us, share us, send us out. Get this information in front of the people that need it. Okay? We want to take good care of you. Again, 855-956-4040. Until next time, thank you for serving. Take care.